Hey guys, this is DMAC. Uh, this is part two. Uh, in my previous video, I was teaching you to serve down the middle, keeping the toss low. Same principle, keep the toss. There's no reason for you to hit, uh, throw the toss any higher than it needs to be because all you're doing is trying to hit and uh, toss the ball in the strike zone. And you can accelerate the racket after contact and you limit the wind getting in your way and so forth. I know there are great players that toss the ball really high, but uh, I'm not really uh, an advocate for high toss. Okay, now you practice serving down the middle. And the reason why down the middle is important is because you keep the ball in play. You take away the angles. Now all of a sudden now you're going to be serving and you're going to serve to the outside. Now I'm left-handed, so uh, for a right-hander, same thing, you know, just you're just playing against a different player. But now if I was playing a right-hander, I'm hitting to the forehand of a right-hander. And uh, usually, you, 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 you know, when you're playing on the deuce court, down the middle, down the middle, and you change it up down the middle and the outside. So now I'm going to serve on the outside, and you want to you wanna hit the, the lines. That's what you're going for when you practice, hitting the lines. Okay, now when you're serving on the out, and this is important for getting speed on your ball, you need to make contact and then acceleration starts from the point of contact. If you know anything about physics, right, when your racket is coming from, it's going up, you're going against gravity, so you don't really need to accelerate then. Just make it nice and smooth and then right at impact, once you make impact, you accelerate. And that's where you're going to get the surprise and those aces come in. But it's in, uh, day in, day out, three times a week I'd say 150 balls down the middle, 150 balls outside, set up targets, aim for the lines. And you could use a little bit of spin and so forth. Now there's three areas you're going to hit and changing it up. You've got to be like a pitcher. So you're in a close match and you're serving and you hit it down the center and the outside. Sometimes into the body is a good way to serve. Now, what I want to tell you, when you're playing tall players, it's really good on big points to serve into the body because tall, tall players can re have great reach. And so if you serve right into the body, you catch them off guard and you can come in if you're a serving volleyer. If not, you probably get a short ball, and that's, when, uh, that's in another lesson and what you do with approach shot. Okay, so I'm going to hit a few more balls and end this, uh, this lesson on the uh, serve on the deuce court. Alright, so it's just about 150 balls three times a week. Down the center on the deuce court, down the outside on the deuce court, and then you do that on the ad court. And then you also practice down the middle after you practice the sides. Okay, and there's a purpose for all those things. And I might just talk about strategies just when I'm sitting at my desk talking to it, but that's basically it. And there's a disadvantage for me right now because I'm the only, I'm the, I'm the actor of this video, I'm the uh, cameraman, and so uh, until my kids get older or, or I find someone to help me with the videos, uh, I can't show you a lot of the things that, that are critical to playing advanced and even top level tennis. Hey, thanks again for watching DMAC Tennis, uh, these videos, and go to dmactennis.com, sign up, register there, I'll keep you updated. I want to apologize, I hadn't made a video for about over a year, 
you know, I got responsibilities and I'm just doing this as a hobby and hopefully my kids will play more tennis. But regardless, I wish you the best in your uh, goals to become better in tennis and thanks for coming and watching and uh, tell other people about dmactennis.com. Thanks.